Hi you guys, welcome to Rachel Jess and today I wanted to go through with you stationery and special stationery at that. This is the Daily Goal Setter Notebook from Mal Paper and it ha and I wanted to show it in video form rather than just in photos just so you can get a real good idea of these fabulous books. I mean look, it's nice A5 size, extremely thick and it is a daily goal setting planner. So if like me, you like to make lists, you like to make plans, you like to know what you're doing and you like to dream big, this is the perfect planner for you. Its features include 12 months worth of planning. It's, um, it's got long, medium and short term goals, monthly, weekly and daily views. Um, and a document holder, which is why it's so thick because of the, the size of the views. Now, about mail paper, um, their aim is to help with your daily productivity, positivity, and motivation. So that is three big ticks in my book. So let's have a look at mail paper's beautiful new daily goal planner. Right. So we're back. So as I said, this is a gorgeous thick planner with beautiful writing. Um, detailing exactly what we've got here so this is our, our daily goal setter i just love the idea of this this planner so we've got our details here to fill in in case we leave it lying anywhere um i highly doubt we will but you never know and then there is a contents list now the contents list broken down is the daily planner setter the cheat sheets goal setting morning routine which is the gratitude, affirmations and daily tasks. It's really important to keep, to stay focused. Um, so we've also got uh, evening routine, weekly routine, monthly, long-term goals, medium talk goals and short-term goals. Now, these, this, is, this is perfect for writing down your plan and putting it in action. So we've got um, a little note here on the daily plan setter. And then we have some information here on cheat sheets on the daily plan setter. Uh, so this is detailing everything, um, helping you um, on what to do for your routine, where to start. Because sometimes it can be, look, you open up a blank page and think, well, that's my brain. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know where I'm starting from. The cheat sheets here help you they help you get focused and they help you break down into bite-sized chunks um, on what tasks you need to do what you need to plan for um, it's that age-old saying how do you need an elephant one bite at a time I'm not suggesting anyone eats an elephant it is just a phrase to say don't be overwhelmed by the size of your task break it down break it down and then break it down again this is where the um, the daily goal setter comes into its own it also has the um, smart goals office based people will know all about this those training um, at CBT and mental awareness will know about this um, and some people might dismiss it because they see it as a corporate thing but it's not you know if you haven't got them set out as smart how are you gonna know you're on the right track how are you gonna know my goal is to own a donkey sanctuary I don't know how I'm going to get there yet, because, but uh, if I break it down and break it down, I have tasks that I need to do to get back to my big goal. And I plan on using this planner to help me with my tasks, because some of my tasks are to learn to do um, upholstery and to learn to do sewing um, alterations. And it's all part of upcycling, getting a business becoming self-sufficient, getting a farm, getting um, a little shop on the side and there's my doggy sanctuary. And so this is, this is to get that though, I need my smart goals. And I love that this has the smart goals in it because some people do poo poo it as corporate. It's not, it's really, really important to keep you focused on where you want to go. So we've got our morning routines, our gratitudes and affirmations. These are so important to keep you grounded and to know what you're thankful for and what you you appreciate in your life. Um, you may be going through a rough time, but find that little one thing 
that lights your fire that just makes you smile for that day or just makes you not unhappy even if it is you're feeling that bad find something that you are grateful for that you are happy for that the birds are in the garden you know it can be absolutely anything and they're so important they're so important to put your mind in the right frame for the day so we've got um using the a b c d and e method um so this is from eat that frog that's that's <laughs> talks about eating the animals isn't it i'm sorry vegan people but that is also just another phrase and um, so your a b c d and e in here so it's um a task that might be complicated uh, that must be completed um should aim to complete this task task is optional task can be deleted and if this task is not completed on the day then it has no consequences so it's, i'm not familiar with this a b c d e method but i'm looking forward to reading through it uh, so once uh, we're through this method here, we also go on to the evening routine. I mean, it details advice, at, well, it details um, guidelines on what you could be putting in your planner for your evening routine. And then we go on to our weeklies and our monthly routine. And then we have little uh, quotes and inspiration. So this world is but a canvas to our imagination. And that's that's it on the notes and and to get you uh, started. So you you know you're not going in blind. It's not just blank. They have tried to help you and they've given you the tools to make this work. And it's tools like I said that um, uh, you would see in studying CBT and you would see in corporate. Um, and they clearly work. Otherwise, they wouldn't be around for as long as they have been. So it starts off with our long term goals. What, when, why, and how. I cannot wait to put this in because oh, we all know now that this is going to say for me my donkey sanctuary. Um, I, I'll get there. I know I've got a plan. It's fine. And then we've got little quotes, which who doesn't love a, a motive? Oh, I like this. They've got motivational quotes all the way through this, inspirational quotes. Um, we must be the change we wish to see in the world. Really important. Right, so we've got our long-term goals, then it flicks to our medium goals, and then obviously we get to our short-term goals. So this is something that uh, you're not just going to pick up and fill out in five minutes. This is something where if you've got a Sunday afternoon, a Monday morning, or if you've got a couple of hours scheduled in, that's when you do it. That's when you think, what am I, what am I doing? Schedule it in, good couple of hours, pick up your book, and who doesn't love? A nice new blank to fill in and just read through the guidance at the front and then work your way through so once we've done our short-term plan we've got our monthly routine so we've got a planner you know the good old planners that we all know and recognize out of all the diaries uh, which we can um, add to what we plan to do I mean this doesn't have you know you this has doesn't have to be as dramatic as a donkey sanctuary this can literally be um, your plans for your blog you want to get it to a hundred thousand views over hundred thousand followers over all your social media or uh, you want to be in the top 10 of something it all goes in here it's absolutely perfect for that now once we get past our monthly goals our monthly planner we get onto the weekly review so you've got your month of what you plan on doing on the month and then you break that down to what you're planning on doing for that week what's going on and uh, these are all marked as well so as you can see down here so this is your this is your um, month and now now we're on our weekly and then when we get to the end of our weekly section here we know what's coming don't we so that's our weekly section and once we're done there bam you're on your dailies so this is uh, three things you're grateful for your daily affirmations so your three things that you're grateful for um absolutely anything and everything couldn't it really uh, you're grateful that you got up today you're grateful that your body um has allowed you to get out of bed you're grateful that um you your feet are planted onto the grass and you can smell the you know that anything and everything you know to think about 
what are you grateful for it's that simple so you've got your, your grateful your grateful here and then your daily affirmations you know i am going to be strong and powerful today and i'm going to smile at everybody you know it could be absolutely anything um use your guides at the front um and it's specific to you so then you've got your daily tasks and notes of what you want to do so anything and everything goes in here doesn't it you know it's a planner at the end of the day it doesn't have to just be um your five day your five year ten year plan it's like what you need to do to get to that plan have you done it tick box job done down the bottom you've got some more affirmations if you want to live a happier life tie it to a goal not to people or things it's all about um building yourself up you can do this you can do this and if you need a motivational quote to get you through it then you read that quote and you feel all warm and fuzzy inside nobody needs to know if you if if you know you're feeling a bit embarrassed or you think all oh, people are they shouldn't do they're not worth it you don't need to think about it you just do you and nothing does you better than you and you know what you want you know where you're going and if you don't you can use this planner to help you find where you're going it's gorgeous isn't it i can't wait um i'm off next week and max is at cricket so i'm going to spend a good morning on the sofa with my feet up and a cup of tea and my planner so i might share some of the pages with you on instagram seeing as you all know now i want a dog sanctuary so once we get past our daily affirmations you know we should be nearing, you know, when you're nearing the end of the book, you should be feeling good about yourself and you should be ticking off plans. And by you get time you get to the end, how far to the, from the front are you from your goal? I mean, how fantastic is that? So at the end, we've got some notes because we all need to keep notes. And finally, I think a bit hard to hold because it's all at one side. Uh, you've got your, I love dotted notes. Does anyone else love the dotted pages? Or is that just me? Um, so we've got our calendars. And document holder. Because you're going to need that. Because you've got plans. Finally, well, so two final things. It's got two ribbons to keep your places. I always find these important. But also, which I just saw, which I love. And I love this on a notebook. It, the elastic because it shuts and if your notebooks and if you're planning this ends up like mine you're going to need this now the reason why I say you're going to need this is because if you're like me you won't just make notes here you will make notes wherever you are um, and if you pick up leaflets or pamphlets of what you want to do you're going out to I uh, don't know a conference you're meeting people if that's part of your plan it's going to go in here and these i don't understand why more notebooks don't have this if i ca if i buy a notebook and it hasn't got this i get um i get some like duct tape or something gaffer tape something nice and thick and i get a bit of elastic and i stick it on myself all my notebooks have this it should just be <laughs> mandatory um so there is the beautiful mal paper daily goal planner and like i said you can start it whenever you start it today you start it when you know what you want and it's yours you know it doesn't have to be someone else's plan it doesn't have to be what agrees with society is it's what do you want and how do you want to get there you might not have all the answers right by now but that's fine because you put that as one of your pla your tasks if you don't know how to get there and one of your tasks is to find out seek out people that do know follow people on social media that know follow people that you um you want to aspire to who inspire you who you look up to um who you admire see what they're doing see how they're doing it you know just do you and what better way than to do you with a little help from a planner so this is the Mal paper planner and I just thought it was nicer to show it in video form than just in a blog post. 
um, post, I will put a blog post up and I'll, you know you can see the pictures and that um, and it'll have the links to, to the website and everything else but more importantly do you there's only one you and thanks for watching until next time I'll catch you later guys see you later bye